So the next tip, tip number eight, is use, um, this one says, using the status bar for quick insights. Use your status bar for quick insights. Yeah, a lot of times I see we forget that the status bar has a lot of interesting insights. So for example, I have this table, and if I highlight this table at the bottom here, I have a sum, obviously. This is a summation, sum all my values. And then someone says, okay, what's the average? What's the average for this uh, brand of, of wine? Uh, Sauvignon, Sauvignon Blanc. What's the average? So what's the average? Basically, I don't need to come here and bring equals to average and all that stuff. That's a waste of time. I can just highlight, and then look all the way down here at the bottom. It's a bit small to see for you guys on the screen. But at the bottom here, you have average, you have count, you have numeric. You have minimum, maximum, sum, and everything there. So that is your status bar. And then your status bar has various options. So I can see average is 17,917. Now, if you right click that status bar, you will see all sorts of options available to you. Lots of options. So these are all the things that your status bar can show by default. All you need to do is tick, 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 tick. And all I did is right click the status bar. So try and use the status bar or remember to use the status bar to show you quick insights of, in, into your data. All right? Status bar is really cool. Thanks for watching another training video from Deep Brown Consulting. See you in the next video.